tonight See the lanterns red and bright Dragons prancing, lions dancing Hear the children cheer Happy New Year! Happy New Year! Think of all the yummy treats Dumplings, oranges, food so sweet Fish and noodles, give me oodles Add a dash of soy Kong hei fa choy Happy New Year, luck and joy Kong hei fa choy Happy New Year, luck and joy Kong hei fa choy Happy New Year, luck and joy Let's celebrate with family And every friend who's dear to me Tasty dishes, good luck wishes Let's all gather near Happy Lunar New Year! Happy New Year, luck and joy Kong hei fa choy Happy New Year, luck and joy Good morning, everyone. How are you doing today? I really hope that you guys are having so much fun learning a lot of new things in all of your English classes. Did you guys know that there's only three days left before the end of January? When I see you next week, it'll be the month of February already and a few more days till Chinese New Year. Have you heard that this year, the year 2021, is the year of the ox? How is that even possible? Why is this year called the year of the ox? And why is it even called after a name of an animal? That is exactly what we're going to learn today. New Year, time to cheer, everyone will gather near Won't be long, ring the gong, year of the monkey song The city's filled with lanterns, hanging up so high Fireworks are ready, they will light the sky People celebrating as the dragons dance I'm lost in all these lights I just can't believe this night It's New Year, time to cheer Everyone will gather near Won't be long, ring the gong Year of the monkey song Painted faces and love the clothes they wear We believe in fortunes and good luck will be here Giving gifts is just another lovely part We celebrate together, it will fill up our hearts It's New Year, time to cheer Everyone will gather near, won't be long Ring the gong, year of the monkey song For the Chinese New Year, all of my family, young and old, come together for dinner. This is called Chushi Night. And then later that night, we light firecrackers and fireworks. Fireworks! I love fireworks! They're so loud when they go bang, crackle, and pop! Yeah, that's the point! The Chinese believe that the loud noise scares away bad spirits. Oh, so that's why. How, how? Why are there always dragons in Chinese parades? Well, many Chinese people believe that they were once dragons. That's so cool! Flying around breathing fire and stuff! Rawr! Speaking of fire, this time of year, everything is red because red is the color of fire. And we want next year to be as bright and beautiful as fire. Every year is a new animal. All 12 of them are what we call the zodiac. New year, time to cheer. Everyone will gather near. Won't be long, ring the gong, year of the monkey song. Whoa, this fort looks amazing. It's bright and beautiful. And ready for the new year. Xing Yan Kuo La. That means Happy New Year in Chinese. Wow! Xing Yan Kuo La! Yay! Yeah! Happy New Year, my new friend. 
The Chinese people name each year after an animal and they call it the zodiac year. A zodiac is an imaginary line that connects different stars forming a constellation and most of them are named after an animal. Today, we are going to learn about the different animals or the different zodiac years. The Legend of the Chinese Zodiac A long time ago, the Jade Emperor of China wanted an animal race on his birthday. The first 12 animals to finish the race will get a place in the Chinese Zodiac. A year will be named after them. The cat and the rat who were best friends asked the ox to wake them up very early the next day. On the day of the race, the ox tried to wake the cat and the rat, but they wouldn't wake up. The ox kept trying, but the cat and the rat wouldn't wake up. The race was about to start, but the ox didn't want to leave the cat and the rat, so he carried them on his back and he started running. The rat woke up just as the ox was crossing the river. The tricky rat knew that he could never beat the cat, so he thought of a plan. The rat pushed the cat off the ox's back. When the ox reached the other side of the river, the rat jumped off his back and ran to the finish line just ahead of the ox. The tiger came third. So the 12-year cycle of the Chinese zodiac begins with the rat. After him came the ox, who was followed by the tiger, then the rabbit, then the dragon, snake, horse, goat, monkey, rooster, dog, and pig. The poor cat had no place in the zodiac. The cat was so angry with the rat that they were never friends again. Let's learn some new words. Rooster Dog Pig Rat Ox Tiger Rabbit Dragon Snake Horse Sheep and monkey. Now it's your turn to name them. It is so much fun to learn about the Chinese Zodiac because we don't only learn about their culture, but we also learn the names of different animals. 
Using this worksheet, we are going to look at the 12 zodiac years or the 12 different and very interesting animals. Now have your mommies and your daddy print this out and we are going to work on it together. The animals in the Chinese zodiac are rat, ox, tiger, rabbit, dragon, snake, horse, goat, monkey, rooster, dog, and pig. Now it's your turn to read all of the names of these animals. What's your Chinese zodiac animal sign? Here come the animals. Here comes the rat. The rat says eek, eek. Here comes the ox. The ox says moo. Here comes the tiger. The tiger says roar. And here comes the rabbit. And the rabbit goes hop. What's your Chinese zodiac animal sign? Here come more animals. Here comes the dragon. The dragon says roar. Here comes the snake. The snake says sss. Here comes the horse. The horse says and here comes the sheep, and the sheep says, Meh! What's your Chinese zodiac animal sign? Here come more animals. Here comes the monkey. The monkey says, Hoo! Ha ha! Here comes the rooster. The rooster says, Cock a doodle doo! Here comes the dog, the dog says woof, woof, and here comes the pig, and the pig says oink, oink. What's your Chinese zodiac animal sign? Let's say them in order. Can you remember them all? Rat, ox, tiger, rabbit, dragon, snake, horse, sheep, monkey, Rooster, dog, pig. What's your Chinese zodiac animal sign? All right. Wow, we learned a lot of new information and new vocabulary this month. It was so much fun to learn about the different New Year celebrations all around the world, the Three Kings Day that Mexicans, Spanish, and Latin Americans celebrate after New Year, and the unique traditions of the Chinese people during the Chinese New Year. Get ready for more exciting lessons when I see you next week. I'll see you next time. Bye for now.